Hi, I'm Kingsley. Welcome to my edition of What's in the Bag. Uh, let's start with uh, let's start at the bottom of the bag. Start with the wedges. I've got a couple of uh, Titleist Vokey SM7s. I've got a uh, 58 degree of bounce with uh, sorry 58 degree with four degrees of bounce and 54 degrees with 10 degrees of bounce, which gives me a bit of uh, variability around the hard and soft conditions we get here at Clearwater Bay. So which would you use? At which time? I use the used to tend to use the 58 with four degrees a lot more in the winter, especially tight lies much firmer. And our bunkers are pretty firm here with all the wind. We're trying to keep the sand from blowing out, so I tend to be using the 58 a lot out of the bunker. But I do find I chip more with the 54 uh, come summer when things are a little bit wet. Uh, you want a little more bounce, a little softer conditions. Uh, then I've got a 50 degree gap wedge and a pitching wedge which is 46 degree. They just did part of my regular set. Uh, which regular set are the Tideless TMB irons from uh, 2018, 718. They've been a fun club. Um, lengthwise, I've got my shafts a little longer. They're an inch longer than standard. Um, I used the uh, AP2s and CBs for a long time, but uh, when these came out in the full set a few years ago, I thought I'd have to give them a go. Something fun, something different. And what did you find by going to inch longer? Have you always been an inch longer? Or? I've always been about an inch longer. Um, it just helps me stand up. I find I get a little too hunched over if I uh, go regular length. And I've got those in uh, three iron through to my pitching wedge and then a couple of wedges. And I jump from three iron up to the fairway wood. Okay, nice. So you don't actually carry a hybrid, you go from no, three iron I to... I tried a hybrid, you know, it be six or seven years ago. I tried a couple of different ones and I just didn't quite get on them. I've always been pretty good with the three and four irons anyway, so maybe I'll try them later on as the swing speed slows down a bit. Uh, so I jump to my fairway wood, which is the TS3. I get the 16 and a half degrees of loft, just gives it a little bit easy to uh, get to better launch off the fairways. Um, I don't find I hit three wood off the tee that much, I probably should at some times. Um, and I've got the uh, Tour AD BB6 extra stiff shaft in that one. Uh, and then the driver is the same, TS3, that one's nine and a half degrees of loft. And that's got the uh, exact same shaft in it as well, the Tour AD BB6. Stiff. And what would you say your average carry is with the driver? Well, Normal conditions? Yeah, them good, probably around 290. If you get some wind behind, you can get up around 300. A little more interested in trying to get them in the fairway than uh, getting them over 300. Uh, and then putter, this putter's been in the bag for a while. This is a Scotty Cameron M1. Um, for those interested in this one now, they actually changed the name to the Fastback. But this has been a great putter. Uh, actually still got the same grip on it after four years and might need to replace that. But uh, this putt has been in the bag and stay in the bag for a while. I've been very happy with it. So that's uh, that's my clubs and then uh, a couple of little extras. Again, I got a little pouch, uh, a couple of odds and ends in here. Always got plenty of spare tees, pencils, pitch repair, I don't mark the ball marks, Sharpie pen. Uh, I like to put a line on my ball. I use the Pro V1. Uh, used that for a long time as well, um, and I put that blue line on there, which I then used to line up the putts. Pro V1 over Pro V1X? Pro V1, uh, just find it goes a tiny little bit higher, tiny bit softer, but both are really good golf balls. Uh, and then I got a nice little, uh, one of the simple uh, range finders, nice little uh, Augusta logo on there, which was a nice one. This has no uh, slope gradient on it, this is uh, purely just distance to the flag really use that just when I go to play other courses um, I know this place pretty well by now so that's what's in my bag look forward to seeing you all soon